DIY solar homestead. So my pool turned green and I cannot control it. So I've been brainstorming for the last couple days because I don't want to be uh, watering the garden with a green pool with buckets because I pulled a muscle in my back about a week ago. So uh, I decided to use the solar pool pump for the solar pool heater right here. So, and it's garden hose connection. So it's running right now, just to let you show, just so you can see, everything's in the way. There we go. That's the pump. Running off that, what is that? That's a 100 watt solar panel right there for all the power to run that water from the pool to the solar pool heater out there back into the pool heats it for free but I decided that while it's green uh, I might as well water the garden with it <laughs> been out here all day long <laughs> I extended the garden that way that way and over there eventually the chickens gonna come out of here they go in the side yard my lawnmower is gone right now Hopefully it's fixed in a week or so, because this is getting out of control. And uh, we'll get the chickens where I can move them every day. I moved them a couple inches every day. I didn't re-injure myself, so I'm good to go. I want all of that back there. Now that it's full of chip, chicken droppings, it's time to turn that into a, a garden. So I can't get rid of the, the tarp yet. We're supposed to get a massive flood here in lower Michigan so uh, I'm just glad I'm not catching the, the big part of it so all of you down Illinois Indiana Ohio take care so get ready for the rains so at least I'm on a hill and it all goes down I got the dehumidifier on in the garage in the basement right now it got a little wet down there too. As I had brought the, the eaves troughs all the way around so that I only have two downspouts. I got uh, two rain barrels to go in there pretty soon. But I got a third one in the in the vehicle so I can get those over there. But I want to use uh I want to use the concrete flat stones like I did for the entrance for the for the pool ladder I want to get the, the big flat stones out there to put the barrels on I know they're gonna tip eventually maybe settle a little bit so at least get the stones down and I'll go from there maybe two or three layers of stones and then I want to hook up the rain barrels and it can turn green in the rain barrels because that will just help with fertilizer to the garden as it grows and grows and grows. I still got, I don't know, there must have been two dozen over there. They're planted now. I still got some there, several in here. Just got those watered with the, the green water. <laughs> so, see the snakes? <laughs> Hopefully I'll have a lot less uh, rodents. Maybe that'll ward them off. There's some more over there. <sighs> All free energy, folks. That needs water. That's just a little tiny. It looks like a purple basil right there. I've been out today snipping the bottom leaves. Because if they can touch the compost, the bugs are going to be on it. They eat it all up. It's like a escalator to go upstairs where all the, the food is. So I tried to have as little contact with the plants as possible with the ground where the bugs are. Yeah, this compost is full of bugs. Every now and again I find a slug and throw it in for the chickens. I think I put six, six slugs in there today. They love it. Probably a half a dozen baby worms. So the 12 dozen worms that I put in here this spring, they have grown. I took a, a watermelon this spring and I chopped it all up. I didn't eat any of it. And uh, I buried it under the wood chips in many places because I heard that's where 
worms like to lay their eggs. So that was a good tip from a guy in Australia. So I got that. <laughs> Thank you homesteaders for teaching me everything. <laughs> so that's it. I'm going to continue watering the, the garden. It is going to be raining tonight, but I wanted to get some of that, that green algae out here probably for the next week before I get that cleaned up. So we got a pool store in the hot and local. So I will be getting, I'll be getting the stuff. I forget what it is. And I don't know the channel I got it from. It's a new channel on my, uh, in my area. So, so yeah, she, she put that video out. I watched it today. I can't think of her name. If I do see it, I'll put the link down below. I don't know if they got a big garden or if they got a homestead, but her husband picked up the granules and it cleaned the pool in a day. So I want more green stuff on the garden before I clean the pool up. All right, that's it. Just thought I'd give you an update. Have a nice sunny day before the torrential rains come in.